so I do not exist. I have about 10 years of pay stubs tummy. I can frigging prove I work here you dirtbag. I will call the SPCA. And drop a dime on your bitch ass. The SPCA that does not even make any sense. And Kimberly, I insist that you call me the doctor. Well Mr. The Doctor, I have important friends in the media. Some of my friends have over 100 subscribers on YouTube motherfucker. I will bring hell down on your scrawny ass. Kimberly there is no reason to be so hostile. I am sure we can work out an arrangement. Hostile? You think this is hostile? You have no idea of the kind of hostility I am capable of. I will kill your plants. I will put sugar in your gas tank. I will talk mad shit. Will you please shut up and listen to my offer you psychotic bitch? There is a great threat to gold our industries. According to Billy we have been the victim of a cyber attack. An attack carried out by the elite hacking group known only as Autonomous. You want me to help you fight Autonomous? Are you stupid Mr. The Doctor? I can barely run a copy machine and you expect me to take on an elite hacking group? Since they wiped out your employment history you are now a clean slate, a blank canvas that an artist like myself can use to create the perfect weapon. Well if I'm going to work for you there are a few things I need to get off my mind. Things I should have told you years ago. Do we really need to do this right now Kimberly? What could you have possibly been holding back all these years? Remember when I told you I was a virgin? Well I lied about that. Kimberly. Does the phrase strap a 2 by 4 to your back mean anything to you? How about throw a hot dog down a hallway? Hot dog down a hallway? So you knew I was not a virgin? I even cried and faked that your tiny penis hurt me. Everyone in Angel Grove knew you were an easy piece of ass Kimberly. Just because you would say oh Tommy go slow, oh it hurts, did you think I believed all that shit? Since we are being honest I should tell you a few things. Remember that deaf girl you hung out with for about a day? Well I banged her in the juice bar restroom. You banged my deaf friend what's her name in the juice bar restroom? You are a disgusting pig. Oh and let's not forget Zach's girl, Angela. I tapped at bitch hard about a dozen times during Zach's birthday party. Really? Well remember Mr. Kaplan? I had sex with him. Your clone? That is right, we had sex multiple times. Oh and let's not forget Harry the putty. I banged the shit out of him. Wait a second. You had sex with a putty named Harry. I call bullshit on that one. Well it is true. I had him tied up in my basement and we banged daily. So tell me Kimberly, how did you keep Harry the putty in your basement without your mother finding out? Well my mother found Harry and she was banging him too. Why do you think my parents divorced? Okay this is getting us nowhere. I need you to pretend that you've received retraining and go back to your normal job in the copy room. How am I supposed to bring down a hacking group from the copy room? Leave the details to me. Kimberly, there's only one person here at Gold Darn Industries with the brains to be a member of Autonomous and you are going to bring them down. Well tell me who is this one smart person? I believe the leader of Autonomous is Tree Name. But Trini is just a cashier at the cafeteria. Why would you suspect her? It should be obvious Kimberly. Trini is our hacker because, well because she is Asian.